we've been getting really powerful messages from Jesse, you know, blinking lights and then um, just some, some, some beautiful things that happened. And, and the world had reached out to me with, with such love and I kind of wanted to reach back out and, and let everybody know what was going on. I wanted to show the world Jesse's message, which is nurturing, healing love, which, which I really believe is, is so powerful. And it was such a powerful comfort to me. And I thought it might be comforting to everyone out there who was grieving with me, so many people. And also, though, I believe that it's inspiration and it's, it's where we all need to move. Nurturing, healing love. A choose love rev revolution is what we're trying to create with the foundation. When is the book scheduled to uh, be published? The book is being released October 29th. And it's on pre-sale now, and we're having a book launch party in the city on October 30th. So, tell me a little bit about Jesse that's in the book. Um, well, I say that Jesse was always kind of larger than life. So, Jesse was born um, at 11 pounds, and so he was a big baby, big voice, and really strong. Um, in fact, one of the things that, that I tell is that um, the first time I went to the nursery to see him, all the nurses were gathered around the window taking pictures. And I kind of walked up and I said, what's, what's going on? And Jesse had crawled to the bottom of his bassinet. And so he was kind of pushed up against the, the uh, glass there, or the plastic. And uh, it was so funny because he was really strong, you know. And uh, so that just, that became you know, his character throughout his whole life. Big and strong. <laughs> what do you think Jesse um, would be doing this year? Well, you know, I mean, uh, you, you have this, the year following the tragedy, so every day you think, gosh, this day last year, I was with him and what what he would be doing he would be uh, happily playing soccer and uh, you know going to school being a second grader and coming home and filling this house with laughter and love and uh, I'm just hoping that he's doing all that in heaven we've had some incredibly miraculous things happen and that's another reason why I wanted to write the book and I had such an outpouring of compassion from everyone all over the world and and there were such miraculous things that I thought would bring comfort to everyone who was grieving with me and uh, and so there are some some pictures and some stories in here that I think um, will bring comfort to everyone and, and will help everyone even hopefully um, those who are grieving their own loss, um, as well as mine.